Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Building a Zoo in Minecraft. I have some terrible news. There are only two kangaroos in here. Again, both males. I'm not sure what happened to the female. I mean, who can blame her? She probably was stuck in here with two males. She thought, hey, I'm getting the heck out of here. But only two males in here. I don't know. The female escaped last time, or one of them escaped last time. I can't remember if it was the female. I have not been able to find it this time, though, so I think she might be gone forever. So we've we've got to restock this kangaroo exhibit with a ton of kangaroos. This is sad, but that's not even the worst of the news, guys. Not even the worst. One of the hippos is gone. I don't know what happened to the hippo either. They both have food. They had plenty of balls. They've got the tire swing. I'm not sure what's going on. These animals, they're just... They're just disappearing on me. They're just disappearing on me. It's it's really a shame. I can't believe Kristen is all alone. By the way, my wife wanted me to name this hippo Kristen after her. Don't ask me why. I feel like it might be a trap. But I mean, the resemblance is... I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Oh boy, if she watches this. Um, well, she wanted it. She asked for it. So yeah, that's kind of a bummer. Let's get rid of this rain. Because of the missing animals, there is something that I've uh, I've built off camera. Here we go. We are now able to access the nether to get quartz. Why do we need quartz? Because we want to build one of these guys, an animal tracker, which requires two blocks of quartz, obsidian, glass pane, and these things. And I have those things ready to go. I've also built a farm over here because I was running low, especially on carrots. I think carrots I was the, like the lowest on. Um... But we're doing okay now. We got we got a few things going. Those I just recently planted. I also need to do like a little bit of a bamboo um, sugar or sugar cane, I should say, not bamboo. A sugar cane farm because a lot of a lot of kibble recipes require sugar, and I don't have too much of that. But for now, we'll be okay. I have a bunch of this stuff here ready to go for our adventure. I even have one pachyderm kibble still left over. I made 17 kibble. I can make all kinds of different kibble with uh, the stuff that I have here. Maybe not with the peaches or the persimmons. I'm not sure why I'm carrying them. Or the berries. Or the beetroots. Actually, come to think of it. And look at all these uh, Look at all these apples I have. 48 apples. I spent like 20 minutes harvesting apples from this tree line here. There's tons of them. Oh, there we go. There's a couple that I missed. So that's kind of good. I really do think I lucked out with my spawn here. Like I've got the spot. Oh, speaking of the spider spawner, let me show you something. I also spent some time building a mob or a spider farm. Okay, look, check it out. Look at that. We're going to need this to build a bunch of nets because we're going on an adventure today and we're going to we're going to grab as many animals as we can. Well, as many of a specific couple of animals as we can. We're not going to grab everything we see because then we'll just end up with a bunch of different animals. And what we want is variety in exhibits. I have no food. I got to look into that Pam's Harvest Craft. Also, you'll notice in my inventory the birds do lay eggs. A cockatoo egg, three macaw eggs, and a toucan egg. We're going to hatch those right now. Where's the way out? I made a little cobble path. There we go. As I was saying, I feel really lucky with the spawn. I've got the skeleton spawner down there. I've got the spider spawner down there. I've got this nice clearing over here for farms. And then I've got a tree line of apples. So pretty much all the kibble supplies I need, well, not all of them, but a lot of the kibble supplies I need are available to me. I guess pretty conveniently, and and by no doing of my own. I mean, this is this. I just got lucky with where I spawned, I guess, or I got lucky with where I traveled, I should say, because I didn't actually spawn here. I actually picked this spot, but I didn't, I didn't expect it to be this good. Anyway, there's a couple things I want to do before we leave. The first is we gotta hatch these eggs. The birds, by the way, as some of you mentioned, are able to actually open the door. I found a couple of them out here already, so that's kind of a bummer. So we gotta change the. Probably just put levers or something. Which means we won't be able to put levers here. We'll have to put. We'll have to probably build this all the way down and put levers on the side. But that's okay. We can do that. Another thing that you guys mentioned, and you are very, very right. We can actually build, or not build. Sorry. Um, put a little water in here, but then cover it up entirely with lily pads. We don't want any open areas here, because these birds will find a way to drown themselves. Because they're crazy. Oh wait, I also made some bird perches. So we're going to we're going to do that too. Bird perches, not purchases. I think that's not a full block. Ah, uh, which kind of sucks cuz now I got to grab it from here, put it there. Okay. You in there and you in there. Perfect. Look at that. Now we've got some water in here. It looks a little better. Let's put the perch, one perch on each side. We'll find a nice little spot here. Maybe like right here. Oh, they're tiny. I thought they were a little bit bigger. 
It's okay. That should be helping with their um, what's it called? The thing, you know. Uh, um, does it say enrichment? That's it. And then we'll put the other one here. So we got enrichment on either side. I also made a little spot for another pond there. Done. I think I just heard this guy try to open the door. We'll worry about that at some other point. I've got to figure out kind of a clever way to do it, maybe. I don't know. Maybe I'll just keep it simple and use levers or buttons. Look at that. You see that? Look at that. Look. Macaw drowned. How? Are they still able to drown? I gotta put some lighting in here too. What the heck? That's terrible news. So here's the thing. I got that message that said Macaw drowned. And I don't remember getting that message for... Well, I know I didn't get that message for the hippo. Or... The kangaroo. So there's hope that there... Oh, there's another egg up there. Come here. I want to get this egg. How do I... Come on. Uh, what the heck? Why can't I... Oh, there's a piece of glass here. Oh, nailed it. Check this out. Oh. They don't always give eggs? Oh. So they're kind of like... Minecraft eggs. I thought they... I thought as soon as you like... Maybe I'm doing it wrong. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. Anyway, the macaw drowned. That's a bummer. But I still love it in here. Hopefully these guys... I mean, they can't. There's no way they're getting in there, right? Are they able to... Because they're small bodies, are they able to, like, squeeze through? Because if that's the case, they can probably squeeze through the tree hole openings. It still seems like I got a lot of them in here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight... And I just heard another egg pop. Where, where is it? Ah, here it is. Oh, we got one! He's a little tiny guy. Don't fall in the water. He's beautiful. Okay, okay, we're spending too much time here. Um, a couple more things before... I, is that a... Oh, that looked like a baby. A couple more things before we leave. This is the wrong side. This is the side. I want to try making some of these lamp posts, and I think they're pretty expensive in terms of like um, iron needed, but I think we should be okay. I could use this, so we'll go like this. Okay. Oh, no. Is it just. Ah, right, there we go. That's the base. And then three is for the middle. And then I believe the other two are like this with one there, and then one there. Oh, perfect. Wow. Look at my memory. So these guys, I think you can make them pretty big. Like, as big as you want them, really. Oh, if the if the gate... That would have been a perfect spot for them. Let's put one right here. Oh, that's interesting. What? That was a lot of materials. I don't have a whole lot of iron. Oh, that's a bummer. Did it go in? Nope, it's just gone. Okay, well... <laughs> <laughs> That's kind of sucky that you can't break it. So do I have to like do this? I do. That's pretty cool. Is it always lit? I don't see anything in it. I'm guessing it's lit. You don't have to right click or anything. What the heck? Am I supposed to like mine it? I'm not going to even attempt to touch it right now, but that was kind of a bummer. Anyway, these lampposts are really cool. There's also like lanterns and stuff that you can make. An iron wall lamp, a gold wall lamp. So there's different... Oh, you got to be kidding me. There's different options. This thing right here, we definitely need to build. There we go. We've got an animal tracker. Now you right click red kangaroo, red kangaroo. They're both the ones over there. Wait, what else did it... The Nile hippo. So the, this thing tracks animals over 100 blocks. And I'm not sure what the second, I guess, thing is. Would it would it track an animal at further away? Possibly? I'm not sure. But it does track animals at 100 blocks. So, cockatoo, Nile hippo, red kangaroo. Whoa, what the heck was that? I don't know where the other red kangaroo is. He, It may have died. She may have died. But I didn't get a notification. 
It could have just run out. Whoa. So I got two macaws. This is gonna be this is gonna be very useful. Look at all their HP is good. If I start to see one of these, oh, his did that two cans HP is not good. Hopefully it didn't get trapped in. Ooh, are you kidding me, guy? Trying to ruin my day? No. Okay. So let me walk over here a little bit and see if I can track. No, it's still only two kangaroos, and then the the hippo only one hippo too. So something happened to those guys. A lot of you mentioned that uh, lions are able to spawn. I haven't seen a single lion in here. And if the lion did spawn in here, for example, it wouldn't be able to get out. And so I would have seen the actual lion in here. And it would have killed the other hippo as well. Yep, red kangaroo, Nile hippos, and a bunch of birds. Dang. Okay, well, this is going to be a useful tool to have. Let's go and make a whole bunch of nets right now. We were able to build... 20, these are 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33. We have 33 nets. These three, or these eight, I should say, are the ones that are already used. And then we've got these three, but these actually two of them have people inside. Don't tell anybody. And then one of them's got the red build Tropic Bird, which he's safely, I mean, they're safer in here than they are out here, apparently. Um, and then let me take my Jeep with me because you never know. Let me get rid. This is all the food I have. I might make some more bread before I leave. I got a bunch of bone meal because the nether, I forgot that because uh, we have biomes of plenty running, the nether has different um, biomes as well. And I found a bunch of bone blocks. And the bone blocks, I mean, you could obviously turn them right into bone meal. So that's kind of handy to have for food as well. Uh, let's put this in miscellaneous. We'll put this in blocks. We will put this in valuables. And I think we're just about ready to go right after I get some food. That's not my kangaroo, is it? No. I have to make the sounds. They don't have sounds for them yet. What the heck is that? Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. That is a leopard. Ooh. Ugh. Okay, so I was about to say that the goal today is to find reptiles. We want tree frogs. What is that? Oh, those are... Are those gorillas? Those are gorillas. This is right by my house. I mean, it's not right by my house. It's... The zoo is over here. And we're over here. I mean, we're, this is pretty close. Okay, so we know where the leopard is. Assuming that... Or a jaguar? Well, I think they're the same, aren't they? Something like that. Uh, we know there's gorillas here. That's awesome. That's not my kangaroo either. Although it looks very familiar. The I, the goal today, I wanted to get more of the same animal that we have. Including... Actually, I should be snagging a couple of these kangaroos. Because we want a male... We have, we have two males. We don't have any female kangaroos now. So maybe I'll do that. We want more of the same animals that we have. And we want... Lizards and a lizard. I, th I think there is a lizard in this mod pack. There's also tree frogs and there's anacondas and stuff. Hi! Yoink. I don't know if that's a male. I don't know if it's a female. Ah, that's, an, that's a red kangaroo too, isn't it? I want like different varieties. Yeah, this is a red kangaroo. That's a male. Let's see what's over here. Uh, that leopard is very intriguing though. Can you imagine a cool exhibit? I mean, I'm going to have exhibits for all the animals eventually. This is a red kangaroo variant. Zero. That's a female though, right? Yes. Okay. So, contains red, contains nothing. Bang. So, we got two kangaroos. Let's not worry about the ruse anymore. We want a male hippo, since Kristen is all alone now. I can't believe I keep calling her that. I cannot believe it. She's, she's nuts. She's going to kill me. I feel like it's a trap. She insists. She wants a hippo named after her. I don't know what's going to happen to me, guys. But if you don't hear about me or from me within the next few days, you know what happened. I'm dead. Um, Yeah, so kangaroos, done. We got two more. I don't know what the first one was, but as long as we have one female, we can breed them. And I think I'm going to take an active... No, wait. That sounded wrong. Not an active role in breeding them. I think I'm going to be more aggressive in breeding them. So... More than one at a time. You know what I mean? Jelly beans! Hello, guys. Hello. I really want to find a jungle because I know there's a lizard. The basilisk lizard or something that spawns in this mod pack. And um, that's available 
in jungles, or it spawns in jungles. Ooh, hold on. <gasps> Hippos? Polar bears? Reticulated giraffe? Grevy's zebra? And the gower? <sighs> should, we, should we kidnap people? We've got the zebra again, the macaw, the hippo, the okapi, I think it's pronounced, and the cockatoo. I think I'm going to kidnap a couple more people. So we've got these two. Next, we have two more people. <laughs> um, these guys are valuable. I mean, I think they despawn, though, if you let them out of the net. So maybe we keep them in the net. <laughs> We keep them in the net until we uh, need them, and then we um, take them out, use them, and then put them back in the net. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know how that's going to work. Maybe if we name them, they don't despawn. So we'll try that. Uh, okay, I have my vehicle. I have my boat. I think we're about to run into some water. So let's get in it, and let's try to find ourselves a jaw. Oh, another one. Hold on. What are you selling? <gasps> oh, no way. Oh, that is so cool. Walruses. The Pacific Walrus. That's so cool. I want a bunch of them. Uh... So instead of taming them first, I'm catching them. We're going to put them in like a holding pen. And then we're going to tame them. Because I find out in the wild, if you're trying to tame, it gets a little bit um, complicated. Because you're trying to craft the kibble and stuff. Plus, I probably don't even have the kibble necessary. Thank you. Thank you. Was there one right here? Thank you. And thank and thank you. We got four walruses. Oh, this is going to... Guys, we are doing well. Oh, this guy's valuable. He, he spawns zookeepers and transport vehicles and macaws and the Indian garia, which, by the way, looks like uh, an alligator. That would be cool to keep on our reptile exhibit as well. Oh, you know what? All right, one more person kidnapped. I mean, once you start the kidnapping game, hard to finish. <laughs> it's hard to stop. Uh, these are all animal traders, red kangaroos. Okay, animal trade. These are all of our Pacific walruses. That is so cool. I didn't even know walruses were in this mod pack. This is fantastic. We're finally getting in our boat now and traveling uh, west. Boating through a marsh now. This is kind of a cool biome. Maybe the Gariel is found here. We got to stay disciplined guys we can't we can't be sidetracked by d adorable walruses speaking of which how come i'm seeing so many walruses today or is that a seal no that's a walrus the tusks have given it away um yeah so let's focus on we need a hippo a male hippo maybe two or three hippos and then we need a bunch of reptiles what is that down there maybe i should probably get out a third person view that's just a tree i thought it was some sort of structure um yeah, maybe we uh, get out of the boat here. Okay, excuse me. There we go. Get out of the boat here and uh, take a walk around to see if we see anything. I hope there's nothing too dangerous in this biome. It's it's all like marshes. Look at the, the, the map. That's really cool. I like that a lot. Is any one of our animals around here? No. <laughs> Can you imagine the kangaroos? <laughs> like, ah, uh, he traveled a long way. Um, okay. So, I don't think the Gariel is here, though. The walrus is just chilling in the water there. I'm kind of excited to make this walrus exhibit now, because I've already got, like, an idea of it in my head. But, I want to make that reptile house. Or, I mean, I don't know. Maybe we'll collect a bunch of reptiles today, but maybe I'll let you guys vote on what you want me to build next. I mean, I really would want a place for new box turtles. I feel like the old box turtles died in vain. I want to I wanna do right by their memory. <laughs> Uh, obviously dolphins and killer whales are going to be in separate exhibits because killer whales are... <gasps> Ooh, maybe we can find the lizard here. I think this is... Would this be considered like a desert island or oasis? I think this is like the oasis biome. I don't know if they spawn in the oasis biome though. But we'll find out. What are we at? What is this? White beach. Tropical island. Oh, for sure. Come on. Got to have some lizards here. By the way, check this out. Look, I'm scrolling through tools because the other tools are in my in my backpack, and now I've learned to do that. Um, the white sand. I need some of this white sand in my life. I didn't bring a shovel. Oh no, I do. I just showed. Oh, I'm such an idiot. I just showed you that I've learned 
<laughs> Apparently I have not learned. I don't think I have this either, right? Yeah, new recipes. So they act like sticks, but what else can you make out of them? What was that? What did I see there? Oh, it was just more banners. Okay, okay. This is all the same sort of stuff. Aha, here we go. Bamboo thatching. Interesting. Bamboo terrarium. That's kind of cool. Oh, what if we had like little terrariums for sale in the gift shop too? That'd be awesome. We got to make a gift shop. Uh, Ender offset wand. Oh, I've heard about this. Somebody told me about this. I think it's going to be important. A paper wall. That'd be kind of cool too. Okay, this is good. Maybe we can grow this stuff, right? I'm assuming you can grow this stuff. Can you plant it? Yeah. So I'm assuming it grows. And once it grows, we'll have as much as we'll ever need. There's some interesting plants here too that I haven't discovered yet. Like these guys. They are the pink hibiscus. Hey, we'll grab those guys too. This is this is going to be a very... I feel like this is going to be a super successful adventure here today. We're going to catch a bunch of stuff that we want and that we need. I've already got some white sand. I've got over a stack of it. I put it in here. And now I'm getting this stuff, which will provide me with new blocks. And... We're going to end up finding that lizard. I have a feeling. That is like the, the white whale for us today. That that lizard. Don't mind me just mining some uh, limestone and marble. What are you? What are you? Uh, hold on. It doesn't look aggressive. A giant salamander? I didn't know those existed either. Another one to add to our reptile house. I think our reptile house is going to be pretty epic. And it's starting to get so big that I don't know if I'll be able to finish it in one episode. <laughs> Just saying, guys. Just saying. I mean, we've already got tree frogs that we want to put in there. Box turtles. The giant sal salamander. The gariel. The uh, anaconda. And the lizard that we want to catch. Which, by the way was not on this island. There wasn't a whole lot on this island, actually. And check this out. This thing is beautiful. This makes me want to start my own survival series or something. Just on the island. Just living on... Maybe maybe a reality show on CBS that will run for seasons and seasons about surviving. Anyway, let's, uh, let's keep going. We're going to continue east, I guess. That was so cool. The giant salamander? The Japanese giant salamanders out there? Yeah. Again, that's another animal I didn't even know <laughs> was in this mod pack. I'll take it. All right, so we've got walruses, salamanders. We've got kangaroos, one of them female. And then we've got a bunch of empty nets that we can still use to catch a bunch more stuff. This is exciting, guys. I hope you guys are having as much fun as I am. Let's continue. Those look like pretty big trees. I don't think I'll be able to use these trees in an exhibit, but maybe... Is this the redwood? I think this might be the giant redwoods. Ocean still says redwood forest edge. Okay. So redwood trees have the best wood. I love the color of this wood. Maybe, I don't know if I'll be able to chop one down. It could take me like days to chop one of these things down. Um, I just want to, I, I, I hate chopping it down, but I kind of feel like I have to. Let's go a little bit further in and chop one of the, one of the trees down like in here. Also, I wouldn't mind a couple of these guys to grow in my uh, in my mushroom farm because right now all I have is the brown mushrooms. So now we've got a couple of those. Boom. We're doing so well. We're getting very lucky with, with some vines today. Anyway, let's chop down one of these guys. Probably this one. And hopefully we get some seeds from it. I don't know how this is going to work. I also don't know how long this is going to take. Because it seems like the thicker the log, the longer it takes. Is it breaking even? Oh. It did indeed break. Look at the lag as this thing falls. Oh, that's a big tree. We got a bunch of pine cones, redwood cones. Wow. We got a lot of redwood from one tree. 
Now that is good. You know, there actually something is something is worrying me here. Let's check the kibble. There's some some recipes for kibble that require nuts. Let's see if I can find it. Was it the beginning? Look at this. The little little uh oh the rodent kibble. So if I want to like uh I guess tame squirrels, they require acorns and pine cones. Now where the heck do you find those? And hopefully they're the only ones. The rest of them look like sugar and meats and fish and stuff. But this one worries me a little bit because I'm not sure I've never seen just a, an acorn or a pine cone. I'm I'm hoping that the dynamic trees mod doesn't override whatever makes those happen. You know what I'm saying, guys? Hopefully that's not the case. This is a cool biome. Look at this, the light shining through the trees. I love this. Oh, anaconda. I don't got buns, hon. Please don't want none. Ooh. Oh, oh, jeez. I got him. Caught the green anaconda. Now I'd like to get a couple more. Okay, so we know anaconda spawn here. That's good. I can't believe he came after me. I told him no buns. Um, here, let's let's go. Let's put the green anaconda here. We're doing really good, guys. Really good. That scared me though. He did a little bit of damage. Was it a lot? I don't I couldn't I can't remember if it was or not. Oh tree frogs. Now this is where we got it. Oh, there's two of them right here. Thank you. Thank you. Let's get this. I should probably here, let's get that. This like on a, on a convenient location. So we got anaconda tree frog. Let's put the tree frogs here because we want another anaconda. We want a couple more tree frogs as well. And I hear you. Oh, look at you. You're a different color too. Oh, somebody's calling me. Never mind. I'm too busy right now. Um. Okay. Oh, it's getting dark. All right. We got it. We got to sleep. We got to sleep, and we got to catch some tree frogs. I can only sleep at night. Come on. Come on. In the meantime, let's grab a couple more empty nets here. What do we got? Three of them right now? We got three tree frogs. It's not an anaconda, but it's a box turtle. And we want some box turtles for our exhibit. Because, unfortunately, the other ones died. All right. So we got a box turtle now. So let's put the box turtle here-ish. Trying to keep these organized. I haven't seen any more tree frogs either. But tree frogs typically, typically spawn near uh the zoo anyway so i don't think that's gonna be too much of a trouble the ant too much trouble the anacondas however i haven't seen one in a long time so if i could find another one in here that would be great tree frog right there tree frog 12 o'clock yoink we're doing so good okay so we got another tree frog these are all tree frogs let's put the anaconda up here we're going to keep going. <gasps> There's another one. Tree frog, not an anaconda. Little, little yellow guy. I wonder how many variants there are. These loons will have their day one day, but today is not their day. Okay, let's get... Oh, wait, that's the green anaconda. Let's get some more of these. That's the box turtle. Let's get some more of these empty nets. We're running out of empty nets. I still want to find a male hippo. How hard could it be? I know they spawn in savannas. Although we haven't really seen a savanna on today's adventure, so we gotta we gotta we gotta get going. We gotta leave this place. One anaconda will I mean I think they might even live in um in in solitude. I don't think anacondas live with friends. Oh that's, I heard him. I heard him. Make another sound. Oh, there's one. Oh, there's a couple. Yoink! That guy looks the same as the one we just caught. This guy, I believe we caught a version of that. Ooh, I like this little green one. I think we caught one of those, too. There's another one of those. Okay, that's it for the tree frogs, I think. It's probably best that we uh, we stop catching th tree frogs. <laughs> okay, so we got those. We still got a bunch of empty nets here. All right, let's keep going. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, that's the leopard again, but I don't think I saw a leopard just now. <gasps> oh, it is another leopard. It's two leopards. That's so cool. 
<gasps> oh no! Not good. These guys could probably hurt me. If they're anything like the cheetah, I am in trouble. Can I climb this tree? No, that would be too convenient. I see something. I think that's another giant salamander. I've got to start carrying a tranquil tranquilizer gun with me. It is. Yes. I got to start carrying a tranquilizer gun with me so I can, when I run into the. Oh, I thought that was a hippo for a second there. I was super pumped. So when I run into trouble, I can at least try to defend myself. Tree frogs, box turtle, anaconda, giant salamander. Lots more empty nets still. Lots of stuff to catch. Wait, what is that? Wait, that's another giant salamander, but a different variant. And then this guy, of course, he sells all kinds of vials. I can craft those vials, so though, so I don't think it's a... Ooh. Oh, is this guy mad at me? Later. Oh, I just wanted the giant salamander. That's all. Was he your friend? Was he your pet? My goodness. Okay. Giant salamander. So we got three of those salamanders now. Now, I don't know if they like to be alone in exhibits. I'm going to actually read up on these animals like in real life <laughs> and see. Um, I know there's been some talk about like the type of trees that I'm using and, and, and the birds that I mixed uh, my cockatoos and macaws together. But if they're both tropical then I don't see a problem with that. Uh, but if, if like an animal, let's say like, um, let's say, well, like a giant salamander, let's just say the giant salamander does not, hi tree frog, does not like being together and they're solitary animals, then I'll just make an exhibit for one of them. The hippo, for example, though, likes to be in pods. And right now, Kristen, can't believe I'm calling the hippo Kristen, I really can't, is, oh, there's another one, but I think it's the same variant that we've already got. Uh, right now, Kristen's all alone, so I kind of feel bad about that. Especially, I don't know what happened to the other one. I guess if I catch a male, I can name it Dan. <laughs> Just casually collecting some lily pads for my exhibits as I search for the Gariel. I don't even know if I'm pronouncing that correctly. It looks like an alligator, but it's not. Oh, monkeys, you might want to get out of the water because I feel like something's going to kill you. Did I see something? Thought I saw something beyond those uh, cattails over there. Could just be another monkey. But it might not be. Let's go over here. Okay, there is a monkey running around here. It's probably what I saw. All right, not a big deal. Whoa, 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 buddy, buddy, buddy. Oh, oh, wow, there's a lot of tigers here. Oh, there's a lot of tigers here. Can I outrun a tiger? The age-old question. Um, I want to get to that village. I think that's a blacksmith right there. We're going. Nothing's chasing me. Everything's fine. Oh, and that's like one of the first times I've seen vanilla horses spawn. This is not a blacksmith, is it? <gasps> Kangaroos. More roos, more horses. Guys, if you guys see a tiger, you might want to get out the way. Like, seriously, you guys, you, you pick the worst spot for your village. What the heck bird is that? Have I seen that before? It doesn't look familiar. Oh, there's another one up top. I want to see what that is. I don't think there's a blacksmith here. There is, however. Don't tell anybody there is a blacksmith what is in your chest oh don't want any of that stuff not even armor i'm gonna try to go the entire series without putting any armor on because whoa lag spike because i feel like in the, in the wild i mean these these guys that go out and and, and look at animals and, and research animals they're not wearing armor they're just wearing their safari clothing what the heck is this <gasps> it's an anaconda no Okay, he only got me once. Yikes, that was frightening. What happened to those goofy looking birds? Oh, that's a new bird. What is that? Are they a tropical bird? If they are, they're going in with the other guys. More variety. Okay, let's, let's go find out. Hopefully they don't fly away by the time I get there. Much like the other birds that just took off on me. Maybe they were eaten by the anaconda. Um, where is, Right here. What is this? What are... Oh, do, 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 do. A peregrine falcon. They definitely do not... Who is dying? 
It's a bird. Probably a falcon. Um, they definitely cannot go into the tropical bird exhibit. This guy's got some problems. Oh, I didn't mean to hit you. I just... A peregrine falcon, raptor kibble. Yeah, it's a meat eater. Okay, they have to have their own exhibit, and we're going to leave them alone for now. We are interested in hippos, gariels, and that lizard, if I can find it. Ooh, that's another anaconda. That is frightening. That, that sound. Okay. I don't think there is... Oh, there's another library in here. I can get more books, but I don't need any more books. I think I'll be alright with what I have. I don't like that sound. Whoa, what are you? Oh, it's attacking him. No! A violet taraco? Feathers with a secret function? Oh, you falcon jerk. I wanted that bird. Oh, man, that, that would have... I bet that would have been good in the tropical bird exhibit. Those those guys absolutely murdered him. What are, what are you... Uh, you're another peregrine falcon. They're all over the place over here. Oh, that's a shame. Okay, so we know... There's at least one under, uh, other bird, I think. I mean, I haven't looked into what kind of birds they are, but I feel like they could probably survive in the um, in the exotic or the, yeah, the exotic bird, tropical bird exhibit. I think they'd probably fit in there. And these falcons just totally killed, like midair murder is what I witnessed. And I only saw the one. They probably only spawn in ones too. Ah, it's a bummer. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Sound like they're laughing at me. No! I caught a Nautilus. I don't know what it is, but I saved it from death. What the heck's a Nautilus, guys? I'm guessing it has to be in water. Should I put it down? Oh, it's in my boat now. Okay. Okay, come here. Come, come here. You're be good in my tropical... Oh my gosh, you gotta be kidding me. You gotta be kidding me. Dude, I saved you. Why are you running away? I accidentally put my boat... I picked up my boat with the net. This guy, he should be thankful for me, or to me. And now... Come on, yeah, yeah, get closer, get closer. Yes! Caught the Nautilus. Awesome! That's gonna be in my, uh... My saltwater aquarium exhibit. That's gonna be fun. The boat should probably not be caught. It's underwater now. Interesting, interesting. Maybe it'll come back up. Let's get the Nautilus in here. We've got so much stuff today. Holy. Okay. Let's just break it. And replace it. And now we should be good to go. Awesome. Whew. I had to save it, right? I had to save the Nautilus. It was dying. It was on the shore and stuff. Look at this beautiful little bird. I think this is maybe what I saw on the side of that mountain. This is a pied avocet. A pied avocet. What do you eat? Fed with sugar. Wow. Sweet tooth. Oh, there's another one here. Different variant. You're gonna you're gonna die, aren't you? Because you're in the water. Pied Avocet. Huh, is it worth it? Let's grab them actually. I don't think they're gonna go in the tropical bird exhibit, but there was a couple of them just sitting there. There's a creeper right there. <gasps> another box turtle. Okay, got another box turtle. Okay, okay. Pied Avocet. A avo avo set yeah it's got it that i think that's how you pronounce it there's the box turtle we've got a few left i still want a gariel G gariel i still want a lizard that's found in in uh, a jungle biome i haven't even seen what is going on with my mouse right now that is really weird um i've got yeah i haven't even seen a jungle biome yet since uh, we started today's adventure we saw rainforest though and stuff like that no jungle. And then we need a hippo. But the hippo, I'm pretty sure one of the guys that I caught, now that I think about it, he sells hippos. So we might just be able to just buy one from him. Might be easier than trying to find one. Um, this is a very dark forest because terrible things are spawning in here. And I do not have armor. So I got to be real careful. That frog looks awesome. I'm not sure if we caught one like that, but I hope we did. Uh, yeah, I just got to be real careful. I don't, I don't get murdered in here. I believe I found Hippo Heaven. 
Look, oh, there's a tiger. Oh, hello. Hi, hi. There's a tiger kind of kind of guarding them. But I'm going to go in there. I'm going to catch four hippos. How many nets do I have, actually? How many do I have left? I have one, two, three, four nets left. That's plenty. I'm going to catch four hippos. Maybe three hippos. I'm going to catch three hippos. And it's going to go wonderfully. Oh, jeez, these tigers. Oh, no, 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 no. Let's start with you. You look like the other hippo that I had. You look like the hippo that I currently have. I'm going to skip you. I like your look. Kind of a kind of a beigey exterior. Oh, man. How many more? Just one more, maybe? Is that thing chasing me? It's not. Something is attacking. So many lions. I'll save you, hippo. And I'll save your friend, too. Nailed it. Oh, no. They're attacking the baby. You jerks. I can't do anything to say. Run, little guy. Run! No, 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 no. Stay with your mother. Stay with your mother. No, don't do it. This is for... I can't. No, I can't. I have to let Mother Nature take its course. Oh, speaking of which, he's going to attack me. That's terrible. That just makes me feel awful. A little baby hippo. It was cute. It was real cute. All right. Well, I'm going to keep searching for a jungle biome. Oh, man. Tigers and lions. Lions and tigers and hippos. Oh, my. Oh, there's another tropical uh, biome there. I'm, I'm still hoping to catch this Gariel or this lizard. But I'm not really having much luck with them, guys. So I'm going to check over there. Ah, uh, there isn't. This is not a tropical biome. This is just a few palm trees. And that's about it. There's red pandas. Red pandas are cute and cool. All right, I think that's going to be it for this episode, guys. A long one. We had a long adventure today. We caught a ton of animals, including four new hippos. Um, I didn't get the Garia or the lizard, but, I mean, we got we got a lot of other animals. And I'm not sure what exhibit to work on next. So, maybe in the comments. Here's what I want you guys to do. This is going to require a lot of teamwork on your part. There's a lot of lions over there. I want one of you... <laughs> Just one to make a comment about which exhibit I should do next. And and then if you agree with that person, don't comment your own comment. Just go ahead and like that person's comment so that I can actually... Oh, hi. You are a blue fish, I think. I would, still, I would still like to put some fish inside the hippo exhibit. And I still have four nets left. Um, anyway, yeah. So look through the comments. People will suggest what, I sh what exhibit I should build next um and i guess i guess like that person's comment if you agree the problem is i'll probably be re already recording another episode by the time you guys leave your comment so um it's it might not work but it might work so let's try it hope you guys enjoyed this episode though we'll see you in the next one Bye bye